Thank you. What's your name? Really good, okay? And of course, in the whole direction, the patient. Rock and roll. Now, has a, of course, we can configure this in, it in a specific pictures as well. This is not usable, but it's nice, right? So, I think the rocks. <laughs> Let's zoom in again and let's get out of the shape and then moving to the right we have the pinch for the mouse. Okay? For the patient using it on the mouse. Open it again and making the trigger that is keeping open it. And moving it on the left, of course this is quite useful. Everybody knows this pinch, the lateral pinch. And it's very useful to grab cards, money, keys, of course, plates, to serve himself in a restaurant, for example, okay, in a buffet restaurant. So, very useful and very powerful, okay? Someone would like to try? Yeah, it's possible to do it, okay? I'm gonna do something that is not polite, okay? But I'm allowed, right? Okay. <laughs> One thing that is very nice on this hand, of course, everybody knows that it's very important to train the patient properly. A lot of patients, upper, upper limb users, are not using anymore their prosthesis because they are not properly trained, of course. And then we have to teach the patient how to know every pinch that is able to do. Of course, this is not a game. We have to show them how to use it and why those pinches? Why 36 pinches? Why is that usable? For grab what I'm going to use the, that amount of pinches, okay? And then, in a functional way as well, we can help and show the patient just how to style the finger. I'm sorry, okay? <laughs> but I was allowed to do that, so let me get out of the pinch. I didn't, I move it, let me get out again. Okay, now it's relaxed. Okay, the patient can install the fingers. What is that? Just keep the finger on the position and then close the hand. I am sorry, okay? I'm sorry. <laughs> Okay, and now it's clear, right? Okay. Entonces, sí se puede. Sí, se puede. Algo muy importante.